Hey, what's going on guys? XDevX here. And today I'm gonna to be teaching you how to install the Sims 2 Deluxe, the original Sims 2, whatever Sims 2 version you have that you have to install. I'm gonna teach you how to do it on Windows 11. This will also work on Windows 10, but I'm on Windows 11. Um, this is for the disc version, not the cracked version. The cracked version is probably a lot easier, but it is considered pirated. So I would just, if you have the discs, that's perfect because I'm gonna show you how to do that. So if you had the discs in hand, what you're gonna to wanna to do is install it normally. You shouldn't have any errors with that. The error saying something with direct X should pop up. I'm gonna actually show it on screen now since I took a screenshot of it when I was installing it. If you get this message, that's good. I mean, that's not good, but it's good because I know how to fix it. What you're gonna to wanna to do is come to the Sims 2, right click it, go to properties, Go to shortcut and at the very end you want to put slash w after you press space once press apply and then okay after that go to compatibility go to uh, windows xp service pack 3 run as administrator press apply and then okay and then just double tap it click yes and um for me it takes about 20 seconds or so for the main menu thing to pop up to press play so don't be worried it's pretty much like natural all right so once this pops up you just want to press play and then you're going to wait for like another 10 or 15 seconds for it to pop up in window mode There we go. So it might be a little small, but you can always change the resolution of your background on your desktop to make this bigger. Um, you can't really like stretch it out or anything, unfortunately, but this is how you avoid that error message with DirectX. You just gotta run it in window mode in administrator for some reason. But yeah, I'm not sure if your computer has a disk drive. I actually bought a USB external disk drive from Best Buy for like 30 bucks. And I have all these old games, as you can see on the side, like Sims 1, like Mall Tycoon, School Tycoon. So I definitely recommend that. Also, if you're trying to do the pirate version, there's probably tutorials on this. You could probably follow the same tutorial, I would assume. All right, guys, that concludes this video. Hopefully you enjoyed. Let me know if it works for you and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.